Hello guys and welcome to Walking Project. Today I'm going to do a quick speed test between the Honor Magic 2 and the OnePlus 6. Now, those two phones has one of the latest and greatest chips on the market. On the right hand side, the Honor Magic 2 has the Kirin 980, which is a 7 nanometer chipset. It has two A76 cores clocked at 2.6 GHz, another two A76 clocked at 1.9 GHz, and another four Cortex A55 cores clocked at 1.8 GHz. The GPU inside is the Mali G76. I've got the 128GB version with 8GB of RAM and the bezel-less display is 6.39 inches 1080 by 2340. And on the left hand side I've got the OnePlus 6 which is basically the same as the 60. Inside we've got the Snapdragon 845 which is a 10 nanometer chipset. It has 4 cryo 385 cores clocked at 2.8 GHz and another 4 Cryo 385 cores clocked at 1.7 GHz. The GPU inside is the Adreno 630. I've got the Avengers Edition which is 256 GB of storage with 8 GB of RAM. The display of the OnePlus 6 is a 6.28 inch 1080 by 22 80, which basically means that the battle is going to be quite interesting to see whether the 7 nanometer chip inside the Magic 2 is going to be actually quicker than the good old Snapdragon 845. Although, because of the difference of the screens, the Honor Magic 2 has to push 65,000 more pixels than the OnePlus 6. So let's get started. Okay guys, so that's how I'm gonna do this test. Performance mode is off at the Honor Magic 2 because the OnePlus 6 doesn't have such a mode, so it will be unfair. So performance mode off, the same network as you can see over here, Vlokin 2.4 and the same, pretty much the same 95% brightness, I've tried my best to color match those screens guys, so they would look pretty much equal on camera. So, how I'm gonna do this test, I'm gonna open up those games over here and these applications and after that we're gonna check the benchmarks, we're gonna test the RAM management and at the end we're gonna run again on Tutu and do a stress test to see which phone heats up quicker guys. So without further ado, let's get started with the games and let's see which one is going to open up games quicker. One, two, three. Let's see which one is quicker. Okay, I believe the Honor Magic 2 was just a little bit quicker guys, just, just a millisecond quicker than the OnePlus 6 over here. Now let's try PUBG, what are we dealing with? Did you see the difference? As soon as I pressed the button it went straight into the game, where on the OnePlus 6 there was a slight delay in opening up the application, but then it caught up. So let's see which one is going to load up the game quicker guys. We might have a new fastest phone. Who that might be? The Honor Magic 2. The Kiri 980. Is it that good? Okay. And the first was the Honor Magic 2, guys. Excellent, excellent, excellent results. Now, let's proceed to the next games. Mortal Kombat 2. Uh, Agdotin. Let's see which one is going to open up quicker. And pretty much both at the same time, guys. At the exact same time, but the Honor Magic 2 for some reason is in quicker inside the game itself. Now let's proceed to Asphalt 9, let's see which one is going to load up quicker guys. Uh, it's very tense this speed test, uh, these are probably the fastest phones at the markets right now. So it's quite interesting that the Honor Magic 2 was actually quicker once again guys. To be honest with you, I never really believed there will be another phone quicker than the Snapdragon 845. Well, up until the 855 comes up in a few weeks time. I have no idea what happened with Asphalt over here, but I'm going to leave it as it is right now. And we're going to proceed to the last game, Angry Birds 2. Undo Stress. Let's see which phone is going to open up Angry Birds 2 quicker, guys. And again, for some reason, it is it going to be the Honor Magic 2? Yes, the Honor Magic 2 is actually quicker once again opening up this application, guys. I can't really believe how quick this phone is. Now, let's check the battery temperatures at the moment. What we are dealing with, 29 degrees over here and 27 degrees. I'm going to press start tracking over here so we can see the battery temperatures, guys. And let's proceed to the everyday applications like Chrome. Uh, Undo stress again. Okay, I believe the... Chrome was quicker on the Honor Magic 2. Now is the time to press 
the subscribe button because I've got both reviews coming down real soon. You definitely don't want to miss those guys. Fantastic phones. Now, let's proceed to Twitter. Let's see. Pretty much the same. They op they've, they've opened up too quickly to see. Google Plus. Uh, each Nissan. Let's see. Google Plus was quicker on the Honor Magic 2 over here, guys. Let's see with the next application, which is going to be YouTube. And all that three. Let's see which one is going to load up quicker, guys. And the Honor Magic 2 was quicker once again. Coming up with Instagram. Uh, in. Let's see. I believe the OnePlus 60 was just a little bit quicker on Instagram, guys. So let's proceed to Hot UK deals. Adin, 2, 3. Okay, and the Honor Magic 2 was again quicker. So overall, when it comes down to speed, the Honor Magic 2 definitely wins, guys. It opened up pretty much all the applications and games quicker. But how about the RAM management, guys? First of all, let me show you some benchmarks. I did the Gink bench over here. And let's see what results are we getting, guys. These are the results that I have. And as you can see, the Honor Magic 2 actually has better scores than the Snapdragon 845 inside the OnePlus 6, which is quite surprising as well. Let's do a quick Casja test to see which phone has a better gaming performance, guys. I think that the OnePlus 6 will have a little bit of a better gaming performance because historically the Kirin chipsets were struggling with gaming a little bit. Especially one of my favorite phones, uh, the Honor, let's see, oh, Huawei, Huawei, yes, Huawei Mate 10, uh, the Kirin 970 inside was struggling a little bit in 4K, so you had to turn the resolution down to 1080p to get some decent gaming performance but now let's see the difference in the water over here is dark blue over here and it's bright blue over here guys very interesting i have no idea what that means but uh well it's a difference um so yeah so i'm really really surprised to see uh if the gaming performance will be on par with the kirin 980 but as i'm seeing the average fps that is not exactly the case, although 110 FPS is more than enough. Guys, so let's see which phone has a better gaming performance, guys. Oh, man. Seriously? Okay. Now, average 93 FPS over here and 123 FPS over here, guys. So the gaming definitely goes to the OnePlus 6. I can't really deny that. So now it's time for RAM management. Let's open up the applications in the reverse order to see which ones are kept in the RAM. Hot UK deals is still there. The Instagram is still there, guys. YouTube is still there, of course. Google Plus is still there. Twitter is still there, I can imagine. And Google Chrome is still there, guys. And now it gets interesting. What about the games? Angry Birds 2 in the reverse order. It had to reload on the Honor Magic 2, guys. So definitely OnePlus better in terms of RAM management so far. But let's see what about the rest of the games. Are any of those kept in the RAM or they're not? There's only one way to find out. Um, Asphalt 9 just refuses to uh, start on the OnePlus. Uh, but it's interesting that it's stuck at the same place as I left it earlier so we can assume that is still kept in the ram at some point let's see if I'm going yeah okay we're out of here so let's see more to combat is it still in the ram more to combat is still in the ram in the oneplus 6 guys and over here it had to reload again unfortunately what about pubg you might say let's see what's going on with the pubg guys is it still in the ram no, PUBG had to reload, but PUBG is quite heavy, so no surprises over here. And the last one, the retro shooting. Man, it's still in the RAM in the OnePlus 6. I am actually surprised. So, to sum this test up before I proceed with the scientific test, guys. When it comes down to everyday usage, the Honor Magic 2 is actually quicker than the OnePlus 6. A huge surprise. When it comes down to gaming, both are brilliant, but this one is a little bit better. And when it comes down to RAM management, the OnePlus 6 completely destroyed the Honor Magic 2. And this is the 8 gig version. If you're looking up to buy this phone, do not buy the 6 gig version because you're going to have some issues. Now, let's check the battery temperature over here, guys. 
34 degrees over here and 31 degrees over here. That's the battery temperature. But let me just do a quick measurement over here to see which phone actually is heated the more. 33 degrees over here. Let's see which is the hottest point. 33.9, 34 degrees over here, guys. And uh, what about the OnePlus 6? Uh, let's see which is the hottest point over here. 32, 33 degrees, 35 degrees over here, probably 34 degrees. Well, it's not big of a difference. It doesn't really matter. So let's proceed to Antutu now. Okay, guys, so I'm going to kill all the applications and I'm going to run a quick Antutu check to see which phone is going to complete it quicker and what the results will be. These are old results. Don't look at them right now. Let's do a test again and see what are we dealing with. See you in a sec. Okay, guys, so the test is almost over and the Honor Magic 2 completes this test first and straight away after that is the OnePlus 6, guys. However, the results are a little bit different. Now, OnePlus is known for cheating on Antutu, so no surprises over here. But let's have a look at the individual results. 97,000 over here, guys. The CPU actually more powerful than the Snapdragon 845. The GPU over here is more powerful on the OnePlus 6. The UX is, well, that's pretty much the software, is quicker on the OnePlus 6 and the memory is actually quicker on the uh, Honor Magic 2. However, you already saw for yourself that the RAM management is not that great. So let's see what kind of temperatures are we dealing with at the moment, guys. 37 degrees over here, 35 degrees over here, guys. And now it's time to test the, uh, well... To do the stress test over here to see which cpu performs better under test conditions guys which means that whether you should expect any kind of throttling at what point and all of that so let's do this test and see what we're dealing with 23 percent over here 22 percent over here so see you in a sec guys okay guys so the honor magic 2 just completed the stress test and for some reason the oneplus 6 is kind of stuck at 99 percent now what i found out quite peculiar is that the battery went to 17 percent on the honor magic 2 and on the oneplus 6 went straight down to actually 11 percent guys which is not very good we can see the temperature over here 44 degrees the battery temperature and let's see how much is the battery temperature on the Honor Magic 2, guys. Actually, 40 degrees. I didn't really expect that. I thought it is going to, uh, you know, there will be, be uh, another difference here. But anyway, let's see what is the actual temperature at the back of those phones, guys. Let me check my measurement too over here. 38 degrees over here, guys. And let's see. 37 degrees over here. Not that hot, 34 degrees at the bottom, 36, okay, what about the OnePlus, okay, 42 degrees over here, 40, wait a minute, <laughs> 48 degrees over here guys, man, this phone got hot, yeah, but anyway, let's see what happened with the stress test guys, well, for whatever reason, the stress test is still not done, and I can imagine that is actually stuck guys so i'm just going to skip the stress test over here come on okay anyway let's have a look at the um uh, honor magic 2 over here what do we have guys so straight away the performance went down to about 70 80 percent and it kept that way all the way up so I can imagine that when you're having, uh, you know, heavy gaming or something like that, you're going to get 70, 80% of performance. But as you can see, not much more throttling. So the performance is going to be consistent all the time, guys. And I have totally no idea what happened with Antutu. I'm just going to kill it. I'm going to just come back in to see how the Snapdragon... Um, 845 deals with that that's an old test that i've done previously and as you can see that actually the performance difference is bigger over here guys you're running at about 60 to 50 percent actually 40 percent under 
you know heavy heat over here so well what does this tells us that in heavy gaming actually the throttling will be greater on the OnePlus 60 compared to the Honor Magic 2 and when we look a little bit further down this graph we can see that the battery temperature was steady at 40 degrees over here on the Honor Magic 2 where on the OnePlus 6 it went from 30 something to over 47 degrees over here guys so just have that in mind so what is my conclusion actually i'm really happy with the honor magic 2 guys i didn't expect these kind of results at all because usually the snapdragon are the latest and greatest but in this particular case the honor 980 is an absolute beast when it comes down to a 1080p screen like the honor magic 2 guys so i'm finally happy to see some competition in the chip market so yeah that was about it for this speed test guys thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for my full reviews of both of those phones is it worth it for the oneplus 6 of course it is and a full review of the magic 2 so until then let me just slide it out like that <laughs> see you later guys